Uh, hey guys, my name's Gus Ford. I'm a design engineer down here at First Build. Uh, new face here with an old friend, Cavern. So I'm standing here with our latest uh, engineering model uh, for the Cavern. This is a GE Profile uh, wine center that we have upgraded and modified to control humidity. Um, inside, you can see we've got a nice, large capacity, two gallon uh, humidity uh, tray here. Large uh, filter um, exchange material. Um, really sharp stainless steel looking uh, design. We've got two trays included with it. Both of these have been evaluated to hang 62 pounds worth of meat. Um, all this system is controlled by our existing Mela control box. Um, what this is doing is, uh, is regulating and uh, controlling the humidity. Um, we've been evaluating this unit for about two months at this point, um, holding right at 55 degrees and 80% humidity and seeing some really great numbers, some great data coming out of this. Uh, so the last time you saw this was based off this unit. It was a mess of wires and components. Um, while that worked good for the time, um, we were able to uh, take our learnings from that and actually modify it here into the next generation. What we were able to do was improve upon that system um, and, and really get some good numbers out of this. Um, so by increasing our filter media, by increasing some of the airflow, um, we've been able to do some really cool things with the software. Even though there are two different systems working here, the refrigerant and the humidity system, uh, getting those to work uh, together uh, was really kind of a challenge. We're gonna package this up, we're gonna send it down to Eric. Eric um, has been working with us along the uh, course of this project. He has actually purchased this unit from us. Um, this is not a freebie. He is gonna give us a raw, real review. He's gonna put it through the paces um, and not pull any punches. Um, I'm a little nervous, I'm a little excited. Um, if you wanna follow along with us and see what he has to say, uh, check out his, his channel, Two Guys in a Cooler, on YouTube. Uh, so keep in mind that this is the latest engineering prototype, um, so it probably will uh, change shape as we go. But this is going to work perfect for uh, Eric and getting him what he needs very quickly and start getting us some worthwhile feedback. So while we try to move fast here at First Build, I don't want to give you the impression that this thing is thrown together. We've put this thing through some paces of our own. We've actually evaluated each of these shelves, hanging 62 pounds of steel off of the very center of it by one single hook. Um, and minimal deflection. So you're gonna be able to load this thing up full meats, cheeses, do whatever you want. Um, so what's really interesting about this is we've been able to not modify the base unit at all. Everything we're adding is completely separate. It can all be removed, it can all be easily cleaned. The water tray comes out. You can toss that in your dishwasher. The lid is separate, easy to clean, low maintenance. So the biggest question with this product is capacity, right? How much can you actually do with this unit? Uh, currently, with just the top shelf on, we've got 21 inches of hanging room here. And again, as mentioned, we've got 62 pounds of capacity that you can hang from a single shelf. We're going to include extra shelves, stainless steel, uh, large enough that you can uh, lay cheeses on them or use them also as hanging. They go right in and give it a really good look. So I need to get back to work, get this thing finished up. We're going to ship it out. Uh, follow along with us, and uh, thanks for watching.